Namaskar loves, let's look at the ingredients for our Telo Balado Indonesian style egg sambal. So the Balado is the paste or the sauce or the sambal. Okay, it's more or less standardized. Okay, now three shallots, a handful of dried chilies. I soak them. Why do you soak? So it's faster to grind or blend or to put in the mixer. Two tomatoes and five garlic. Now I've added uh, a small piece of a uh, blachan or shrimp paste roasted already. Now this is optional because for some vegetarians they do consume eggs. So if you're vegetarian, no need to use this. So this is going to be blended or pulse. And then we have four eggs already boiled. Now we are going to fry the eggs to give it a nice crisp coat on the outer. If you want to use more eggs, go ahead. Then for scenting, we have bay leaves and down the purut, uh, kaffir lime leaves, okay? From my garden, ha ha ha, all right. Now, a tiny bit of palm sugar for the mixed blend of a tiny bit of sweet tinge, optional as well. You don't like, don't use. And then salt, now salt sparingly because belacan is also salty. And what's with this uh, bird's eye chilies? In case you feel that the sambal is not spicy enough, add this towards the end, all right? Now, why? Because sometimes you don't know the type of chilies you buy. Until you use, then you only know the level of spiciness. So one of the tips, uh, once you have done with your dishes, you feel that the chili didn't give in the kick of spiciness that you yearn for, then you have the bird sized chilies to add in. And oil, let's fry the eggs. Be careful, huh? it will spread them. As you fry, keep turning so we have the crispy coat on all the sides. The eggs fried and removed. Now we reduce the oil and we tip in the banana. You can pour some water inside here, mix and pour inside as well. So cook until they become aromatic and the scent of kitchen and the oil flows. At this juncture, it's about tasting and adding whatever flavors you need. So I'm going to add the palm sugar, a tiny bit of salt. The spiciness is okay, so I'm not going to use the uh, bird's eye chilies or dried chilies and then I put in the bay leaves now taste if you need lime juice please pour if you want to use tamarind juice please go ahead so let's cook to reduce now while waiting for the balado to reduce let me give you some tips what can you do if you have this extra sambal you can cook with your veggies you can also fry it and then you use this as topping you can also have it as an accompaniment or your chacha or your dip for your noodle dishes. So it's very versatile, this uh, balado paste. Now, if you want more of the sambal, then you have to pour water. But let's cook still. You barely see the oil floating. Otherwise, you'll get the raw smell. At this juncture, I'm going to add the eggs and I'm going to add the lima purut leaves. Now if you want the drier version, then you cook down the balado sauce further. And then you just stir and we are done. Take care guys. I'll see you all again. Love you all. Bye.